Hey guys, Shane Starnes here of DroidForums.net. You know me better as DroidModderX. If you guys have been paying attention to this channel uh, over the past few weeks, you probably noticed uh, that we've been doing a lot of stuff on the ice cream sandwich that's supposed to be coming out here in the next few weeks on the Galaxy Nexus. Uh, a lot of things have been ported via the SDK. Uh, I've shown you guys how to install an ice cream sandwich lock screen, how to install the ice cream sandwich uh, boot animation. I've shown you guys how to install the ice cream sandwich fonts. And today, I'm going to show you guys how to easily install an ice cream sandwich theme uh, that was created by developer Dave Cover. It installs easily in Go Launcher and also in ADW X Launcher, uh, which are just home screen uh, replacement applications. This does not require you to be rooted. This does not require your phone to be modded in any way from the official stock firmware. Uh, you can just apply the theme directly over uh, your chosen application. So without further ado, guys, I'm going to show you guys how to install this ice cream sandwich theme on the fly, and I hope you enjoy. Okay, guys, so the only requirement to run this ice cream sandwich theme by Dave Cover is that you have either the Go Launcher or the ADW Launcher installed. Uh, all you have to do is go to the Android Market and search for Go Launcher X or ADW Launcher X and uh, you'll find them there in the market see Go Launcher X is free ADW Launcher X is two dollars and ninety nine cents and I'll show you guys the difference between the two there are you know little subtle differences um, once you have those installed just go home uh, we'll start out with a Go Launcher and just hit your menu button go to themes now you'll notice with Go Launcher there are several themes here to choose uh, from, and you can also go to More and then go to the Market to get more. Okay, for some reason it's not taking me to the Market. Anyhow, you see that there's several to choose from. Ice Cream Sandwich is the one that I downloaded from the Market that I'm trying to show you guys today. All you have to do is click Apply, and that theme will be applied, and it automatically changes your wallpaper. Uh, you'll notice that your hot seat icons down here, uh, that is now ice cream sandwich style. Uh, your dialer has changed, your contacts, your text messaging, your browser icon have all changed. Uh, the only thing that's not themed here is your Google search and, of course, your notification bar. That's not themed. Um, but it just gives it a new look and feel here. Uh, like, see the little home button there is themed. Uh, so now you have, like, the look and feel of ice cream sandwich with the Go Launcher. Uh, to install it on ADW Launcher, just select ADW Launcher X, and of course the theme's already installed there. Uh, but if, if it doesn't happen for you like that, uh, you'll go to More and ADW Settings, and then you go to Theme Preferences. Uh, let's see, ADW default theme is what it comes with. If you downloaded Ice Cream Sandwich from the market and installed it, it'll be there automatically and look like that. All you have to do is apply the theme. Select OK to apply the wallpaper as well. And go back and back. And here you have the theme. Uh, some subtle differences here in the hot seat applications. Uh, the app drawer is not ICS theme. Uh, but the Google bar, the Google search bar, is themed, whereas in the Go Launcher, it's not themed. Uh, so some people will like the ADW version better. Some people will like the Go Launcher version better. Personally, I like the Go Launcher version better because I like the little app drawer icon. Um, so guys, it's real simple, real easy. Check out the link in the description for more information on this theme from Dave Cover, and also include uh, the market links in that link, and you can discuss this as well. Uh, guys, thanks for watching. Subscribe to the channel. Check out droidforums.net for all the latest in Android news. And uh, you can follow me on Twitter at droidmoderx. Thanks, guys.